wanderer, here to lick my father's boots. Good job. My god, this Jarl's kids are jerks. Anyways, welcome back, guys. Welcome to Skyrim. I am uh, in Whiterun, just having spoken with the Jarl about um, the dragon and going to uh, the uh, to see the Great Beards, whoever those guys are. So, I'm just gonna check to make sure nothing crazy is going on in town here, and then I'm gonna shut off the recording and... Oh, there is something crazy. I suspected as much, but... Hello. Oh dear. We got vampires. We got scary vampires. Oh dear. Do not want to die. Do not want to die. Do also not want to accidentally light some pork on fire. Do not light. Okay, is there somebody else? Yes, there is. Let's get him. Okay. I managed to not get in trouble. Looks like important people didn't get killed. Greetings. Vampires. That's kind of scary. Anyways, as I was saying, um, that's cool looking armor. We're going to um, sell some stuff, get some sleep, do some errands, and then uh, yeah, then I will uh, get back to you shortly. But Master Vampires in White Run. That was kind of scary. And of course, I'm carrying too much to be able to run. Fortunately. Okay, well, that's not going to be very helpful, is it? Wait, something really heavy. Dragon Bone, big surprise there. Oh, man. I'm definitely going to have to get rid of some of this stuff. Well, let's just dump some of this. Steel, wolf pelts. We'll pick these up in the morning. Torches. Oh, that's not everything. Jeez. Steel armor. Man. Dragon bones is pretty high up on that list, isn't it? Oh yeah, that, that reminds me. I was going to drop the weight of those slightly. The default weight. Just a bit. So... Anyways, yeah, I'll let me just do that quickly. Dead the dragons. I wanted to drop it by about five, each of those by about five pounds. Just really for sanity. It's 15 pounds is a little high as far as I'm concerned. So we'll go with 10 and five. There we go. Okay, now I should be able to carry some of this stuff. all that trouble for pretty much nothing. Oh well, that's okay. Vampires. Scary stuff. Alright, I will leave you here and get some rest, and I will see you on the flip side. Hello, I'm back. Done a few errands around town. I've gotten rid of some stuff. And enduring yet another thunderstorm in this in this region. It's kind of insane, actually. Anyways, I'm just going to do a couple of odd jobs here while I decide what to do. So at this stage, I've got two um, options. Well, three, technically. Three options I could do right now. I could do some odd jobs around White Run to earn a bit of coin build up my uh, reputation in town here and gain a few levels in the process. I could go and pursue this in. shouting you know thing. Take a seat by the fire and I'll send someone over. Or, or I can go uh, head to the College of Winterhold. Now my instinct is let's go find out what this shouting thing is. Um, because it's new, it's unusual, and it might be something cool to throw at people at the Mage's College. Alright, Redguard Woman. A 
I was looking for a red guard woman, I think. Let's see, is she around? I thought I saw a it's lady really here. Cool, friends. I was hoping to find some way to thank you. I hope this does the trick. That was completely random. Let's see, is she up here? No. Probably in the back room. If it's a mercenary you're looking for, you there found she is. It. There's no stronger sword on What can I do for you? Uh, did you know some Alkir warriors are looking for a Red Guard woman? Are you sure? Oh no. They found me? I need your help, please. Come with me. I need to speak to you privately. Alright. Come with me. Mm. I want to hear what this lady has to say. Because... I don't trust those guys. I don't trust them at all. So, are you working with them? You think you can take me? You so much as touch me and you're going to lose fingers. Once was a hero I mean it. I'll, I'll cut you and need right. something. Uh, what's going on? So the Alakir know where I am? What did they offer you? Gold? How many more of them are coming? Tell me. Oh, relax, I'm not going to hurt you. Then I need your help, and there isn't anyone else I can trust here in the city. Uh, maybe? What do you want? I am not the person that the people of White Run think I am. My real name is Eamon. I am a noble of House Suda in Hammerfell. Interesting. The men who are looking for me, the Alakir, they are assassins in the employ of the Almarie Dominion. They wish to exchange my blood for gold. I need you to root them out and drive them away before they find me and drag me back to Hammerfell for an execution. Hmm. How am I supposed to get rid of them? They're mercenaries, only in it for the money. They're led by a man named Kamatu. Get rid of him, and the rest will scatter. I don't dare show my face, lest they recognize me. So you'll have to find out where they are. Hmm. Any suggestions on how I find them? I heard one of them was just arrested trying to sneak into the city. If he's locked up in the jail, perhaps you can get it out of him. Please, I know I'm asking you to do something difficult, maybe even dangerous. I just don't know who else I can trust. Well, you know, the sense of... Uh... Find me the moment the Alakir are taken care of. You knew one was sneaking into the city and didn't worry you? I don't know about that. You don't sound too bright some somewhat. All right, I'm full. Water. All right. Well, we'll look into that. Even if you were a bit rude about it. I'll live. All right, let's see. We have a lot of people here. They say the college has been snooping around Sartal. Mages in the burial pit. No good can come of that. Mm -hmm. Are you saying this province is only for the ugly and so? Carlotta, Carlotta, who are you? Citizen. What do you need, my friend? I don't have to take that. Someone giving you trouble? That bard Mikhail is begging for a dagger up against his throat, the way he goes on about me. I heard him boasting at the bannered mayor, saying he'll conquer me as a true Nord conquers any harsh beast. Huh. I'll have a word with him. If you want to try, go right ahead. I don't think anything will get through that thick skull of his, though. All right. Farewell. Let's see what we got here. That would be this. I'm telling. I heard. How? Yeah. You? Those were All right. Of you're a bard. I don't really like this. I'm a bard by trade. Perhaps you've heard of me. Nope. But you need to leave Carlotta alone. Carlotta put you up to this, didn't she? I'm sorry, but that fiery widow is mine. She just doesn't know yet. Oh. Alright. Ah. Leave her alone or else. Oh, hey there. I didn't mean to make you upset. On my honor, Carlotta won't have to worry about me again. Okay, well apparently I'm a little intimidating. It's the leaving that's hardest, I know. Alright, mm -hmm. that was unexpected, but awesome. I've got a hungry daughter to feed, so selling my produce is really the only thing I care about. That's nice. Mikhail won't be bothering you anymore. Really? You convinced that loot player to stop chasing me? 
I'd thank the gods, but I'll settle for thanking you. Here's some coin for your help. Nice. I'll take it. Mm -hmm. Who are you? Theoden. Whatever it is, you can probably wait. Apparently it can. Cool. You're the best. Can you be my mother? Let's see, who's this guy? Hooded guy. I saw a guy in a hooded cloak. Who are you? If you're looking for the court wizard, I'm not him. Farangar is the one you want. All right. If you wish to speak with him, you'll find him somewhere in the general direction of boredom. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, there's this invention called wine that requires my immediate attention. Wait, I have some questions. Oh, all right, if you must. As the Nords say, make it quick. Brevity would be my favorite word if it didn't have three syllables. Now, wine, that's a good word. Short, sweet, intoxicating. People love wine almost as much as they love whining. I'm one of those people. Okay. I could go for a good to make a vintage 399 right now. It's so hard to find third era bottles, though. The Blasted War is what did it. Oh, right there. Okay. I think I'll just let you get back to your drink, because you're just a little insane. You must be, uh, hmm, interesting. Battleborn? Who are you? Is there anything you need? No, nope, apparently not. Boy, so it doesn't sound too well. Sigurd? Come by Belathor's shop at the market. Ah, I'm yes, sure we've Belathor's something. assistant, of course. Alright. Well, let's go outside. Honestly, I think it's time to start the walk. I've been thinking about it, and to be perfectly honest, I'm right behind you. Ooh, it stopped raining. Awesome. To be perfectly, perfectly honest, Kasari is going to pursue paths to power, and honestly, she can come back and do some work for these people anytime. So, it looks to me like we are going to head towards the Grey Mains. Or the Greybeards, or whatever they call themselves. Uh, let's see, is there anything right else behind. I can do here? Um, I suppose I could talk to him just to get that out of the way. That's a uh, job for later. Nettlebane is a little later. Northeast. Oh, I'm heading in that direction, but. Ugh. Book story. I, I've got to look into that. Feindal. I got a few things to do on the way. I'm gonna go out past Helgen. Family sword. All right. Let's go up to the. Let's go up to Dragon's Reach and you have a work, work with this. Um, Staying safe, I hope. I heard the gourmet is hiding this out. Prison. This uh, prisoner. That's the Sky Forge, isn't it? This is not the route I thought I was going. Okay, up the next flight of stairs and then around. It's quite the place. Damn those gray mates to oblivion. They want to back the storm cloaks, they'll get what's coming to them. Indeed. Apparently. Hmm. It's a lovely, well manicured place. Alright, we're going in. Into a dungeon. And it wasn't because I got arrested by accident. How awesome. Alright. Everything's in order. Good. 
Glad to hear it. All right. Hey, hey. Hey, don't you walk away from me. Get back here. Get back here. Come on. Come on. Don't be shy now. What are you looking at? I need to find Kamatu. You have a death wish then? If you know that name, you must know to meet him would be to meet your end. But it seems we both have needs, friend. Perhaps we can help each other out. What is it that you need? I have dishonored my brothers by being captured. And so they have left me here. My life with the Alakir is over now. But I have no wish to die in this god's forsaken land. If I can be released from prison, I may start over. See to that, and I'll tell you what you want to know. All right. Um, how much to pay? How much to pay your? One hundred gold will secure my release. You can afford that, can't you? I suppose <sighs> you'd better hope you can, if you want the information. Get the money into the hands of one of these guards, and I'll tell you what you want to know. Hmm. Farewell. All right, let's get this guy out of here. There has been talk amongst the gods that you are dragonborn, but such a thing, surely that's not possible. Uh, probably is, man. Uh, I want to pay that prisoner's fine. Done. Convince him to stay out of the city while you're at it. All right. How... How did you get in there, Lydia? Still here. Mm, all right, then. All right, let's talk about how we can help each other. You buy my way out of here, and I'll tell you what you want to know. Yeah, your fine's been paid. Now tell me about Kamatu. Very well. Kamatu is west of Whiterun. It's an unassuming little cave called Swindler's Den. You realize if you set foot in there, you're never coming back out. They'll kill you. But that's your problem, not mine. Apparently. God! My fine's been paid, okay. now set me free! Sorry, oh, she's my ears aren't so good. You say something? <coughs> All right. See you later. Let's um I'm right behind you. I think we'll uh, do a bit of sprinting here because sprinting helps improve my armor skill. And improving my armor skill will make me a better armored caster, which is an option. Start the walk to Riverwood. We're, go we're gonna go through Riverwood. I think it's a safer route to uh, get to. Um... You have the Jarl's confidence, friend, and so you have mine. Who are you? Oh, there once was a hero named Ragnar. A hey, drunk. Been riding to right run from old Rorik's dead. Indeed. Okay. The white room guard. The hoods sure look cool. Onwards to adventure. I could buy a horse, but I think I won't. <sighs> oh, of course I'm tired. How tired am I? Tired, but not tired enough. You know what? I am going to make my way to Riverwood and stay in the stay in uh, Riverwood. 
Seems like an excellent plan to me. Who are you? Carriage card. Cool. Alright. So, that's Whiterun. A lovely city. Thunderstorm, dry lightning storm. Well, it might start raining here soon. Let me do a bit of running here. All right. Hmm. Traveling alchemist. Oh. stormy night. Alright, so, we'll uh, crash the night in Riverwood, and then the next day, we'll make our way to, where was it? There was a job near Helgen. Where was that? Oh, northeast, oh yeah, Nettlebane. Orphan Rock. Let's. What the heck? We'll go check that out since it's on our way to visit the Greybeards. I really should be traveling with my uh, weapons at the ready. Wolf. skill. Alright, let's not be too threatening to the random guy walking around on the road. Who are you? <laughs> a traveling merchant. Take a look. Anything useful to me? Not especially. Anything I can sell? Really. I I'm good for now. I really did just do a whole bunch of work on that, so. Oh, another group. Who are you guys? We've got huh? Odessa. Yes. And Bonnie, yes. a traveling merchant. Couple. All right. Oh. Butterfly, butterfly, butterfly. Luna moths. Ooh, those are useful. Ooh, torch bug. Is that a torch bug? That is a torch bug. And I can get there without getting too wet. Let's see, what else do we have here? Any more creatures? Look at the lighting of that lantern there. I don't know, it just looks really good to me. dare try and get away on me. Water. Oh, look at all the butterflies. Come on, jumping for the butterfly. Jump for the butterfly. Yes. Because butterflies seem to make pretty snazzy potions in general. Pink Luna Moth. Let's see what else we got. Oop, oop. More butterflies. Luna Moth. Oh, there's that Feindal guy I have to talk to, isn't there? Where is he? Alright, markers on the map. Hmm. Because it'd be nice to get some of that off, that off my list. 
Let's see, he's definitely here in Riverwood. Probably in his house since it is evening. Which one is his? It's this cottage, isn't it? Alright, it's locked. We will come by in the morning. Dry lightning, that is cool. Come on, go lower. Come on. You're a cool looking thing. Something cool. Alright, fine. the wings off butterflies for fun and profit here. Well, mostly for... Um, heh. Interesting, he just refuses to fly lower, doesn't back. he? Alright, let's get some rest. <sighs> I never have gotten around to actually crafting a uh, sleeping roll, a bed roll. I'd probably be sensible at some point in here. I believe I have the survival skill set right now. Hide, clothing, misc. So that's not in here. I'm right behind you. All right. Room for the night. You're that visitor. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. All right. Let's go get a good night's sleep and we'll pick up again in the morning. Ten hours of sleep should be good.